Hello everyone and welcome to my Q&A. In this video, I'm going to be answering some of the questions that you guys wanted to hear from me. So number one is, do you dox it or do you miss being around dogs during quarantine? I do. I haven't been regularly dog sitting every week. I have done some overnights when the owners are out of town, but I haven't seen dogs in months. There are some occasions where I do dog sit for the day or overnight, and that is just because I know that they're clean and they are going out of town and no one's home. So under some um, circumstances, I do dog sit, but it's not four dogs a week that my schedule was in February and I really miss dogs because it is really important that I get some dog therapy in too because that helps me regulate my emotions so I definitely miss dogs but I know my cousin's family has a dog I have their neighbor that I dog sit for and then I also have my provider's dog that I work with on the weekends that I can work with too that has a dog um at home so there are a few dogs but yeah i really miss spending and bonding with dogs and walking them too number two how old are you i am 24 years old so i'm in my mid-20s and i started this youtube channel five years ago so when i was 19 i can't believe i changed so much while creating these videos for you guys what is your passion? My passion right now is traveling and I wanna raise a guide dog. That has been a passion of mine for a long time. It's been on my bucket list and I think that is my goal in life is to raise a guide dog. That's been on my mind for 10 plus years, but I think it will be a good fit because I don't want a dog, but I wanna raise a puppy and I have been experiencing raising puppies and dogs, and I think I'll be a really do good dog trainer. So I think raising a dog, especially a dog, would be beneficial, and I'll just have the dog for like two years max, and I can take the dog places, and I think it'll be a really good fit. Um, number four, are we gonna live alone someday? Yes, I'm going to live alone someday. Um, I am interested in living alone, but not right now, um, but I know I want to live alone. I want to have a house and skip the apartment search, so yeah, that's going to be on my list too in the future. I don't know how soon, maybe five, ten years, I don't know, but yeah, I am definitely want to raise a, um, like my animals and then definitely maybe have a house and I want a ranch house. So just one story and I have plans on buying a house. So stay tuned for that. I don't know when, but that's on my list too. Have you been using your air fryer? Eh, no, <laughs> not recently. I haven't. Uh, no, I haven't. <laughs> um, haven't been doing much cooking. I've been cooking the stove a lot these last couple of weeks, but I don't really cook in general, so I haven't been using my air fryer. Um, number six. Do you want to have a boyfriend someday? Mm, no, I'm actually happy being single. I don't want a boyfriend. <laughs> Honestly, I'm fine being alone and having my friends to hang out with, but no, I don't really have an interest. If a guy comes along and I see him and we have the same interests and he respects me and has good boundaries so like I do, then yeah, I'll be interested, but not right now. I have no interest. Um, number seven. Oh, you only want your break, 2020. Nope, I have like two more weeks of school. So I didn't have Thanksgiving week off. I actually was in college that week and that was like a couple days ago. So yeah. Um. I'm still a college student and it is my fifth year being a college student and I'm just taking a couple classes a term, maybe one class a term, so I'm just taking online classes. So I've been doing it online for like a few years now, so I have experience when it comes to that. But yeah, I'll have winter break for like a month and that'll be starting up soon. Number eight, what do you like to do? 
day trips or overnights. I like both. Honestly, day trips are so much fun to do, but I definitely like doing overnights if it's a longer drive or longer trip and I want to spend a lot of time there. I love both, but I feel like I like overnights, but um, day trips are easier to do, so I like doing that. Um, what do you want to do in 10 years from now? I imagine myself owning a house, raising a guide dog, and having a part-time job. Question 10. Do you still like making YouTube videos? Yeah, I love documenting my life. Look how many videos I have. 640 videos? That's a lot of videos of my life. So yes, kind of makes me emotional now that I have all these videos to look back on, but yes, it is a big part of my life. Number 11. What is your favorite holiday treat? Mm, I love pumpkin bread, chai teas, bakery items, dark chocolate pretzels. I like all of that stuff. Mm, so good. Number 12. Do you like doing Zoom with your friends every night? Yes, I love doing Zoom. I love having Zoom meetings and being a part of the disability community. It is really fun to be involved and have fun and catch up. We do some movie nights and we have a great time. And it makes me in a better mood when I'm social and I get to see my friends online because right now I don't really see any friends unless I'm walking with them on the weekends. But yeah, I miss seeing my friends. So it's really nice to see them on Zoom. Number 13. How is your mental health? My mental health is good. Pretty good right now. Trying to figure out what I need to work on. I got referred to a um, OT now. So I need to find a therapist for OT. So just to help me with my senses and to help me regulate my emotions and finding some equipment that will help me relax better too. So, um, Besides that, seeing a therapist, having my providers with me, um, it's going well. And eating and exercising, that contributes a lot to mental health too. And I'm doing good at that too. Number 14. What do you want to do in one year? My life will probably be the same. I have no plans of any drastic change. Maybe look for tiny homes, research houses, um, discover myself more, um, live at home. No big plans in the next coming year. I have no trips coming up, so nothing big, but hopefully I'll do some more day trips and overnights and I'm still going to be a college student and maybe see some dogs, but I don't know now because it's kind of like the virus is killing everything. So we'll see what happens, but yeah, no big changes, but definitely working with my providers is really important for me and having a routine and making more friends in the community. So yeah. So that is like my little q and A. I I hope you like it. And if you have any questions for me, um, you can just suggest it in the comments below. And then I will be doing another Q&A soon. But yeah, it's been fun to document my life on YouTube. It's been really cool to have all the milestones and memories I've been doing. So yeah. So I hope everyone has a great day and I will see you guys soon.